we're ready for step four, evaluation of your recently planted native warm season grasses. Landowners routinely want to know what they should look for after planting. If sufficient moisture and proper soil temperature are present, seedlings should emerge in May or early June. Dormant seedlings may not germinate until the soil temperature has warmed sufficiently in the spring. There can be other grasses and weeds emerging at the same time. Weeds make it harder to evaluate a new planting. A person unfamiliar with native grass seedlings might assume the planting has failed. Many good native grass plantings have been destroyed because seedlings were not correctly identified. Fields planted with a no-till drill produce identifiable rows of new seedlings. Seed that was broadcast into a field will have no apparent rows, making it hard to identify. If in doubt, you can dig up a few seedlings and look at the attached seed for positive identification. Little blue stem leaves and stems are flattened even in the seedling stage. Leaf blades are very narrow with pale hairs on the edges of the leaf, especially near the bottom of the leaf. The stems on big blue stem are generally round and the lead blades narrow. There is a small scale-like collar where the leaf blade joins the stem. If you're unsure of what's growing, talk to a native warm season grass expert with the Department of Conservation or the NRCS. Above all, have patience because native warm season grass seedlings are slow growing during the first year. In addition, it is not uncommon for some seed to wait until the following year to germinate. A new native warm season grass seedling's first priority is developing a root system to withstand hot, dry weather. Top growth is relatively slow while roots are developing. Another aspect of new plantings is seedling density. Native grass seedlings will not be as dense as fescue or other grasses. An excellent mature stand of native warm season grass might have only one plant per square foot, while a fair stand has only one plant per square yard. Individual plants will become quite large. To summarize evaluation, seedlings emerge in May and early June with adequate soil moisture and temperature. Weeds can make native grass seedlings difficult to locate. Native grass seedlings are slow growing in their first year. An excellent stand of native grass may have one plant per square foot when mature.